Greetings and salutations, welcome back to our Let's Play of EU4 with Red Bastard. We are playing as Andalusia. We last left our nation, we were invading this, uh, 13 colonies. And we might be able to knock Burgundy out of the war. We certainly can eventually. But I think we could peace England now before too long. Let's see if we can get anything else from any of our states. Do that. Let's add them points and then send them cash. Um, but we're pretty far ahead, so that's not too super important. Really need is better military attack. And more manpower. Okay, let's try to kill these ships, see if they actually join him. They did. Uh, another. Wasn't worth. Figured we'd kill some of the small ships first. That didn't pan out. Oh, we can't even siege that down. We need 22 units of troops. Okay, well, I think we're gonna draw this war to a close. Let's try to bait them onto that capital. See if we can kill some of their troops. Okay, Madeira. Here is an island. Yeah, I don't care. It's not going to spread from there. Okay, those mountains, we're not going to siege. We're not going to attack them in the mountains. But once they leave, it's deserts. Wow, they burned our colony? March up here, get them. Let's see if we can catch them up there. What? Okay, so we inflicted some damage there, and these trips are still over here. Let's move up here and see if we can take their capital. Yeah, I'm not sure if there's any easy way to get war score here. That army's just sitting down there. Maybe we could capture this capital. Maybe along the way, kill these guys. Our allies and our own subjects. Thank you, Papacy. Now, this is just draining our manpower, so let's just fall back. Uh, yeah, we'll pick these troops up. Oh, 
They're going to get their ships in here in time. So we'll just fall back as soon as we can. Oxygen. Okay, that time they lost ships and we didn't. Hopefully we can wipe these guys out. Let's actually chase them. Chase is on. Okay. Yeah, we'll try to kill these troops and then move down here. Put our military tech up, so now we'll be fighting a lot better. And I think Burgundy will probably leave before too long. Pull this guy back, he'll get home first. Yeah, this isn't our most glorious victory yet. I didn't realize that England had built up so many big ships. It's ten reasons. They would agree to peace, but we want more than that. I actually want to take their stuff. Okay, so they would agree to giving us a single province. That's not good enough. I'm going to take more. Okay, we got their capital. Mass nine reasons. Okay, let's see what they're willing to give up now. Okay, so we need those three. That one. That one. That one. And that one. We're not too far away. I think you're going to have to give us that too. So we'll see if we can get um, Brittany out of the war. And what might help with that is marking off the path. So we're going to try to wipe out their army. See if we can occupy some more territory over here. Oh, we lost a bunch of war score. And let's put this general in charge. Everyone in. Might have too low of morale. But I doubt it. Okay, so we want to liberate that, 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 that one. Okay, the big fleet isn't over here, so let's push our way through these two. Not sure what they did to get more war score. Oh, 
seem to have anything over there. Might just be that they captured another fort in Mexico or something. Maybe they won some battles in here. I'm not sure. Okay, let's see if uh, Burgundy wants to leave the war. Minus three. Okay, we're back up to 14. See if we can kill some of their ships. We want an admiral for it. Okay, we lost ship. But we won the battle and stopped their blockade. Merge up here. Uh, they've got that other army coming up, so they might be able to win. Those are hills. Let's get down here. Okay, that was a really bad move on their part. Hopefully we'll kill these guys, and then they'll just run into us. No, it didn't happen. Well, actually, it kind of did. Okay. So they're retreating over here somewhere. Let's see if we can find where they're going. And wipe them out. And now their enthusiasm is low. But I want to kill these guys if we can. Okay, Burgundy, sure. Okay, that gives us 23 War score. I think that's enough. Then we're going to take this. Kind of separatists are those. Iroquois separatists. Okay, so then we want what else? Can we try to split their nation in half? Just to screw with them? Uh, we could take some forts or something. Yeah, I think that's the way to do it. That's what happens, 13 colonies in England. That's what happens. Okay, that was an ugly victory. I'm going to need to keep troops in here. I'm going to have a lot of debt to pay off. I'm going to have some ships to replace, but a lot of them are outdated anyway. Well, of course. Uh, 
Golden Gun's no longer a great power. <laughs> Replaced by Castile. We can Castile, when can we invade them? One more year. I'm not going to have the manpower to do that. Right away. Let's see, how many of these do we have? Okay, let's kill these guys. And then march down here. These troops... Well, we want to break off. Those four and some of the cannons. And we'll get those guys back home to Europe. These guys will kill rebels. Keeping that in our time. 16 minutes, okay. Sorry. A friend in from out of town. Okay. Uh, as soon as this video is over, I'll deal with that. Okay. So we've got a bunch of mercs. Probably want to use them. And I think this would be a tough fight for us. Until we've got some manpower. Dealt with our money issues. It's, don't really want to grant monopoly charters here because they could get more influence. I think we could afford to upset them for a little while. Get off a bank loan and check to see if our subjects are not in any debt. Yeah, their debt. 1400. <sighs> 1400. Again. I mean, they were sieged out, but you get 1400 debt. Try to save up some cash for them. Oh, hey, we got some points there. Let's try developing. Let's speed up our institution. Okay, so that's present. And then it'll be spreading around that. Who wants more land? Oh, Ma. Give him something down here, I guess. So instead of paying off their debt, we're going to have to save up for our institution. Okay, pick these guys up and take them on back. Here. Let's go ahead and leave these two guys. On those. Those are mountains, so we're going to wait.
And shift consolidate. Check our way into here. That's good. I didn't want Molly to dislike us. War exhaustion 13. Yeah, we need them to recover. Get rid of that war exhaustion, otherwise it's just going to be a bunch of rebels over and over. Just be behind like that guy and that guy. And get down here to help. Okay, probably don't need this any longer. Let's just work on our allies. Our colony new Cody declared war in Vinland. What's going on with Wichita? I think they just got they just got their independence, let's see. Just got 168 ducats. Yeah, once we get troops up there, we'll attack them. Thinking that we should just start eliminating some of these people in here. But of course, we don't want you know bunch of war exhaustion or anything like that. Okay, so let's see how quickly they would fall. Anyone who's isolated would be ideal. The uh, Wichita, I think, is pretty isolated. we we'll use these troops to restore order, and just send these guys up here. And we do have our own war exhaustion that we want to burn down. I guess that's up here. They've got... Oh, Vinland's got... Restar. Now... Vinland is still a colony of Norway. So I think we might just attack Norway. Well, attack Vinland. And kill those troops. Because otherwise, they're going to lose territory. We're going to have to deal with it later. Okay, where are you going? Wait till we're in the same province as them, preferably in these hills. I'd have a three-star general, but doesn't mean sh you should attack us in the hills, man. Okay, where are you retreating? Here? Yeah, we can't go there. But what we can do is go up here and take your capital. And we can pick up... Mercs. We have here. And the cannons. And drop them off in Norway's capital. And end this war quickly.
Hopefully. Hopefully. Get okay, two siege. General. They just have a capital fort. Yeah, I don't, I don't think it'd be much of a problem. Okay, where is this? Alicia. We don't want it to spread. And we'll deal with his rebels in a second. We gotta end this war quickly, because it's bringing up war exhaustion for all of us. Okay. I'm gonna get rid of these guys, because they're an expense that we really don't need. Okay, we'll go hunting after them in a second. Let's just deal with the rebels first. I'll give our manpower a chance to recover anyway. And we'll land these guys here. Sorry, Norway. Nothing personal. Okay, so we captured that. Don't want to pay for this guy. He's that beat up. We've got 45 war score. We're crushing their fleet. We're gonna kill the rest of their army up here. And blockade their other port. Didn't think that their enthusiasm was gonna stay very high for very long. We get rid of him, not quite yet. Okay, low enthusiasm. They want their money. And they have to give us that. Hmm. We're going to start converting. And then coring whatever we can. So some of that did go to our subject. Let's get rid of this 384 guy. He's no good. Right, back home with us. Now we're still waiting on some more manpower. Still want to bring down. Let's not give you that excess because that would give them access as well. So you actually don't want it, you just don't know that. Whoops. And to use the other kind of consolidate. Shift consolidate. But, you know, whatever. Hurting colonists, separatists will kill them. And how far away are we? Uh, we need it to spread a little bit further. Uh, let's see how long this video's been going on. 30 minutes exactly, so I'm going to stop here.